Hey everybody, what's up? I'm Mason the Mason. In this video, I'm showing y'all how to pour a cantilever pool deck. So, you know, forms ready to go. If you want to see that, check out my last video. Got the truck here, a bunch of guys. Mi madre, family, uncle. What's up, what's up? So we got to wheel it around the back here. Got my mom over here taking care of the edges. So the first thing you got to do, you got to take Pam, you know, the cooking spray, and spray the actual styrofoam form. Then uh, we push it all up. Make sure you're not getting the edge too dirty. That's why my mom's doing it. She's clean, she's good at it. Watch out, we got Billy coming behind us. Woo. You know, pretty common sense, but don't dump the wheelbarrow in the pool. <laughs> Fuck that, then I get to make money to come out here and clean it, dump it right in. <laughs> Dave's making sure it's getting under our lip there. Can you give us a, a quick uh, look at how to make sure the, you don't get honeycombs? Oh, baby. Thanks, thanks. So she just, uh, you know, yukes it down or, or shakes it with her mag and then uh, taps the outside. And that's pretty much it. Thanks, Mom. Moving right along. So we got the guys wheeling. Dave's, you know, getting her all ready for me. My mom's working the edges. I'm coming through with the Darby, making her flat. Good process. So yeah, we just go around the rest of the pool like that. My mom does the edge, making sure that there's gonna be no honeycombs, just uh, shaking the concrete, tapping the edge. And then I took my screed and went around the rest of it and screeded it. Uh, my uncle took care of the edges on the outside, not the inside, my mom did the inside. And I just kept pulling the screed and my cousin raked for me. And you just do that all the way around the pool. And that's pretty much it for the pouring process. Uh, once you're done with that, I come over, I think in like a second, I grab a bowl float Bull float the whole thing, that's what I'm doing right now. Bull float everywhere. Make sure it's all smooth, making sure not to put too many uh, divots in it. And then my mom's going along that small, skinny side and putting the edge on it. And I'm gonna start on the other side of the pool and put an edge on it. Then uh, we'll meet in the middle. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Just uh, bull float it, edge it, and that's it. So we full floated it, cut the edge in, you know. Now we got uh, putting swirls in it. My mom uh, has a specialty there, you know, swirls. Anyway, I got a maggot first. So first thing you're gonna do is clean off your form. Maggot. And rub it back in. You want a clean form that way, you know, it doesn't pull crumbs all over. Back in, mag the rest of it, and then she's good to do that. And then we highlight the edges. Oops. That's a good shot. Yeah, yeah, good job, mom. Thanks, honey. Professional. Even got Uncle Willie out here. Silly Willie. Yep. So now we gotta get the knee boards out. Can't reach it from our feet. Keep going right around the pool here. And then once we're done with that, I'll show y'all how to take off the uh, inside cantilever forms. So that's all we do. We just keep going around, moving the knee boards, uh, keep magging it, and my mom keeps brushing it. And then I'll follow behind her with the edger, highlight the edges, and just do the same process all the way around the pool. If you notice in the background with that dirt, they're moving stuff down there and it's so dry. I don't know what the heck's going on down there, but it was just dust all day long. It's kind of cool to see it in uh, like fast time like it is right now. So kind of cool. I like it. All finished with the finishing. Now we got to take off the cantilever. So I got to get the swimming suit on, hop in the pool. The first thing you got to do is you got to take all these little ties out, the bigger fours. So all you gotta do is just twist them in a circle until they break. They're not breaking. Okay. 
and they come out like that. You throw them in the bucket. So I'm gonna go around and take all them out. Oh, there it goes. So first thing I do is break the seal, and then start peeling this off. Make sure uh, you know all the sticky stuff comes off. Oh. I'm gonna use this as my flotation device. Show you that in a second. Yeah, take a razor knife and slice the bottom so you can get this tape off. I got a bucket of water and sin film, con film, whatever you want to call it, concrete retarder. And I sponge this down the whole way, one piece at a time. If you get too far ahead, it'll start uh, setting up too fast. You won't be able to keep up with it. Next thing you gotta do is get a paintbrush, brush away all the boogers. Just brush along it, and that's the finished look. The last thing you want to do is you want to wipe the edges down, make sure there's no concrete on them, and it should look like that. All done. The only thing left is to strip the outside forms. If you got any questions, just leave them in the comments. Uh, be happy to answer them for you. Thanks for watching.